Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To set the PDF settings used to convert the currently opened file in Excel, Word, or PowerPoint 2013 through 2010, click the Preferences button that appears in the Create Adobe PDF button group on the Acrobat tab in the ribbon to open the Acrobat PDF Maker dialog box. This dialog box shares many tabs and settings between all three applications. In this lesson you will learn about these shared conversion settings and also the application specific settings available to each. On the settings tab that appears you can set PDF Maker preferences within the PDF Maker settings section. This section is the same within Excel, PowerPoint and Word 2013 through 2010. You can use the Conversion Settings drop-down to select a preset of settings to create the PDF. You can click the Advanced Settings button on this tab to create or modify a preset of settings as was shown in earlier lessons within this chapter. You can check the checkboxes shown in this section to enable or disable each setting shown. The View Adobe PDF Result setting will show the converted PDF in Adobe Acrobat after conversion. The Prompt for Adobe PDF File Name setting will prompt you to create a name for the PDF file that is created by using the Save as Adobe PDF File dialog box. The Convert Document Information setting will embed the document metadata information, such as the title and author, into the PDF. You can use the PDF-A Compliance drop-down to select a PDF-A standard to which the PDF should comply. In the Application Settings section of this tab, you will then see both shared and application-specific settings for each application. You can also check or uncheck the checkboxes shown here to enable or disable each setting. The first four settings from Attach Source File to Enable Accessibility and Reflow with Tagged Adobe PDF appear within Excel, PowerPoint, and Word. After that, you will then see application-specific settings, which we will discuss for each application. The Attach Source File setting will add the current file to the PDF as an attachment shown within the Attachments panel in the Navigation pane. The Create Bookmarks setting will convert worksheet names within an Excel workbook, slide titles within a PowerPoint presentation, and headings marked within a Word document into bookmarks within the resultant PDF. You can also specify more detail for bookmark conversion on the Bookmarks tab of this dialog box within Word, which we will discuss momentarily. The Add Links setting will add any active hyperlinks within the file to the PDF. The Enable Accessibility and Reflow with Tagged Adobe PDF setting will embed tags in the PDF. Within Word only, if this is enabled, you can also check the Enable Advanced Tagging checkbox to integrate advanced tagging for enhanced accessibility into the PDF. For Excel only, the Convert Comments setting will convert comments within the workbook and add them to the Comments List section of the Comment pane within the Task pane. Note that Word has more advanced comment conversion options available on its Word tab within this dialog box. PowerPoint simply cannot have its comments converted into PDF. One option for PowerPoint is to move any comments into the Notes page for Slides, which can be converted to PDF, and then to use the reviewing features of Acrobat itself for comments. Also, for Excel only, the actual size setting uses the actual size of the worksheet when converting the file and will not resize the worksheet content. The Fit Worksheet to a Single Page setting will scale a worksheet so all entries made on the worksheet will fit on a single page of the PDF. 
the fit to paper width setting, we'll scale a worksheet so that all worksheet columns appear on one page of the PDF. Finally, the prompt for conversion settings setting will launch the Acrobat PDF Maker dialog box that is used to select and reorder the worksheets at the beginning of the conversion process. For PowerPoint only, the Convert Multimedia setting will convert linked audio and video into a flash video file or .flv file and embed it into the PDF. The Preserve Slide Transitions setting will convert slide transition effects into PDF transition effects. The Convert Hidden Slides to PDF Pages setting will convert any hidden presentation slides into pages within the PDF. The Convert Speaker Notes setting will convert speaker notes within the presentation to text notes that can be seen as a separate layer shown within the Layers panel in the Navigation pane. On the Security tab, which is the same for Excel, PowerPoint, and Word, you can set standard PDF security settings for the PDFs that you create. PDF security is covered in the chapter titled Document Protection and Security in the Advanced Acrobat Manual if you would like to review that information. Now the settings that follow are only available for Word 2013 through 2010. There are no more settings to cover for Excel and PowerPoint. On the Word tab, you can check or uncheck the check boxes shown to enable or disable the settings listed. The Convert Displayed Comments to Notes in Adobe PDF setting will convert comments in the current Word document into Adobe PDF Notes. If enabled for a document, then the comments will appear within the Comments section at the bottom of this tab grouped by Reviewer. You can click the Include column for any reviewer listed in the comments section to remove the X from the box shown and remove their comments from inclusion in the PDF. You can click the Notes Open checkbox if you want the PDF notes to automatically open in the PDF or if they are closed for the selected reviewer. You can change the color of the reviewer's notes in the PDF by repeatedly clicking the color column to cycle through the possible PDF note colors that are shown. The Convert Footnote and EndNote Links setting will convert links in those areas of the Word document within the PDF. The Convert Signature Fields specified by PDF Marks setting will convert signature fields indicated by PDF Marks within the document. If you enable this feature, read the message that appears and then click the OK button to dismiss it. The Bookmarks tab allows you to control the creation of bookmarks within the PDF for documents that have the Create Bookmarks setting enabled on the Settings tab within this dialog box. You can check or uncheck the checkboxes shown at the top of this tab to enable or disable each setting. The settings are Convert Word Headings to Bookmarks, Convert Word Styles to Bookmarks, and Convert Word Bookmarks. You can then use the list at the bottom of this tab to make individual changes to the conversion settings of any word headings or styles. To not convert a heading or style, find the heading or style to exclude from conversion and then click its bookmark column to remove the X from the box and the heading or style from the PDF. For all headings and styles included for conversion, you can choose into which level of the hierarchical structure of the PDF bookmarks panel each heading or style will be imported after making a selection from the level dropdown. Now after applying any settings that you want to apply to the PDF conversion using the Acrobat PDF Maker dialog box, click the OK button to apply them. 
Note that, if needed, you can click the Restore Defaults button within this dialog box to restore the default conversion settings. To create a PDF of the document with the currently applied settings, simply use the Create PDF button within the Create Adobe PDF button group of the Acrobat tab in the ribbon. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.